Greetings, one and all, and welcome back to Spore, the epic game in which we play as species. And uh, yes, as you all know, we went from the cell stage through the creature stage and now have reached the tribal stage in the previous episode. So yes, let's do that. Let's play the game. We are starting in the tribal stage. In the previous episode, I said that I would test around a bit off camera, and I did do that. But then what I decided to do, as you'll see now, is I decided not to save my game. So here we are, right in the beginning of the tribal stage where we left off in the previous episode. But at least I now know a little bit about what to do. So yes, these are our three tribal members. They have names. Chieftain Murdry, he's, he's the boss guy. There you go, you can zoom in and out on the camera. And then you've got Danda and Palesla here. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> So yes, they have all these cute little interactions sometimes when, you, when you're not telling them to do anything. <laughs> and watch what happens if you right-click on the fire here. <laughs> they do their little tribal dance. We can we can twist the camera around a bit. Wait, let me just get this right. There you go. You can turn around, go any which way. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Ta -da! And what that does is apparently it increases tribal motivation or some, some such thing. Not sure how it works practically, but it's really funny. I think I'm going to keep the camera pointing to the north like that, so that the arrow points to the north, because then my ASDW keys make sense. And uh, yes, we got our food stash here and our main hut on this side, the tribal hut, in which we can go into the tribal planner or make a baby, which we will do shortly. But first, I think we need to get some food. So that's what we'll do. Let me show you on the side. Go walking this way. And you'll see that there are other creatures in the game, like like these guys over here. M's, apparently. They're just called M. Um, and they would be food if we were carnivores. <laughs> but we're not, so we're going to eat the fruit of the trees. And just like in the creature stage, uh, yeah, we eat this fruit. But it's a little different, see, because what happens is they collect the fruit. The chieftain can hit them all off the tree and, and and collect them off the ground. Come on, Danda. You can do it. What's wrong with you? Come on. And uh, so, yes, then once they've collected a basket full like that... Hey, check these guys out. <laughs> but yeah, these things are all still in the creature stage. There, there aren't any tribes yet. Uh, yes, once they've collected, then they'll come back home and deliver it to the food stash over here. You'll see, there's the chieftain, and plus five. Nice. Oh, you know, and there's actually something I should have done before we started collecting food. In fact, chieftain, come back here. Stop. Just let this guy deliver his food. Actually, no, wait. Maybe I can get it in time. Come over here, and go into the tribal planner. Here you can buy various things. Got the maracas, and the flaming torches, which we can use to uh, either defeat our enemies or make them our allies. But no, that's not what we're going to do now. Right now, we're going to go into this tribal outfitter, which is similar to the uh, the thing that you know from the, from the other stages. But instead of body parts, we add different items of clothing, which also give us bonuses. So that's very cool. And, uh, oh, I didn't actually... Ch like, I showed you, but I didn't tell you what I did in the previous episode with the upgrades here. As you can see, we got upgraded weaponry on our tail. This is a spiky spitter, also an upgrade. And then we got hands and feet, better hands and feet. And I put these uh, sort of unicorn things on the elbows here. And the horns go to the shoulders. I can't remember if those were already there. But yes, all different upgrades for, for charm and, of course, weaponry, etc. And I, I really like the look of our guy now. He's, he's really looking good. Oh, uh, you know, this is a bird creature. It reminds me, this weekend I... I found two baby birds and, you know, they were abandoned under a tree and I tried to look after them, but they both died. So that was really sad. Uh, <laughs> I haven't looked after anything for for quite some time since South Africa. And I, I really wanted to, to help them and, you know, maybe have two baby birds as pets. But no, one died during the night and the other one died uh, the next morning. They were both really weak. Anyway, yeah, just a, a little tangent there. So yes, you'll see we've got different upgrades, 
and I already chose while I was testing, I, I decided we're going to take these things, the body box for gathering and social level 2, gathering is for food, social is to help us make allies, and then we got the different masks here, social or combat, or social and combat, and that's the one I'm going to take, and uh, then we got the fancy pack for gathering, Again, I want to take gathering as much gathering as possible because food is very important. And then we got camouflage for health, and yeah, this stuff I'm not going to take. The one for health I'm going to take is this here, the body Aegis or Aegis for the shoulders. Let me show you just as an example. But, you know, we uh, put them on the shoulder there, <laughs> and then make this smaller a little bit. Maybe position it lower down and twist it a little bit, and there you go quite nice. Sort of more on the arms than the shoulders, but it looks good. And yes, they provide health level 2. Oh, and also we're going to give ourselves a symbol. Stun rise, glee clips, or the spore gears. Now, I like glee clips. Glee clips. Put that on our chest as a tribal symbol. It doesn't do anything, it's just for looks. Yes, there we go. I like that. Leave it just as it is. Maybe twist it a little bit in. There we go. Nice. Alright guys, let me just get outfitted and I'll be right back. Okay, there we go. I like it. I put these things on the back of the head there. And I got this on the chest. Actually, that can go up a little bit. There we go. And the headdress, I think, looks really cool. The spikes coming through it like that. It's actually a mask, but it looks more like a headdress because I wanted to keep our eyes exposed. So there we go, nice and equipped. And as for the look, I think I'm going to keep us looking like this because we changed quite recently. So yeah, when we when we change again, it'll, it'll be later. Yeah, he looks awesome. <laughs> so let's do it. Let's go back. We got the, the bonus to food now. So if I take a look now. Come on. There we go. If we go back down here. When we deliver the food, oh no, it was plus five because he collected before the bonus. No problem. Okay, so now I think we're going to make a baby. <laughs> a new tribal member, we can have up to six. And there you can see he's a little egg, and once that goes all the way around, he, we can use him as a member. What's his name? Baby what? Come on. Why can I not select him? <laughs> Stop running around you. I don't get it. What, what's wrong? Why, why can I not? It's very strange. Uh, there we go. There. Baby Fiolan. Oh, and look at that. We have, we have a new tribe. <laughs> okay. Awesome. A rival tribe of Splurg has formed on your planet. So we are going to try and make allies with those guys. I already know all of this. You can pause the video if you want to read it. But yes, so now... Oh, did I tell you about the refreshing storm and the fireworks? I don't think I did. Fireworks is similar to the siren song. What it does is it makes whatever, you, wherever you do it, if you do it close to a different tribe, you make them friendlier towards you. Like these guys, the brown village, they're just, they're inert. Oh yay! Fiolan is now an adult. He's a tribe member. Nice. Got to put him to work. Make him go and collect food. Actually, no. He can be the guard. Come to think of it. Yes, he can be the guard. Because wild animals sometimes come to try and steal our stash. You see. So I'm going to get the chieftain to help out with the food here. And as I was saying, the, the fireworks helps with relations between tribes. And refreshing storm. You'll see here, like, these trees are bare, right? don't have any fruit in them. Um, and on this side too, maybe? I think we're collecting from here now. But basically, Refreshing Storm gives the trees back their fruit. I'm going to wait a little bit before I do that, because, because I think it affects all the trees everywhere. But it's very nice to see. Yes, they, they do eat <laughs> while they are working. Hey, is he going back with just one bit of fruit? Okie dokie. So yes, guys, let me just collect some fruit, um, and then once we've got enough, once we've got enough food, I'm going to uh, make, what we'll be doing is we'll be making this over here. 
the maracas stand and the flaming torches stand because that's the two tools that you use to to make allies or defeat your enemies so we'll need those so yes let me just collect some some more food when i've got what i think will be enough then we can then i'll be back i think i'm going to make another baby <laughs> pop hey who's in there and what are you doing <laughs> So another baby, here we go, baby Caters. Very nice. Caters, Feel Lan. Feel Lan, you're supposed to be guarding the stash. Get over here. Oh, and check this meteor out. So I'm collecting food, slowly but surely, but... Oh, and look at this! Whoa! I think this is an epic. Let's take a look here. Uh, i got to swing the camera around. <laughs> yes, oh my gosh. Oh, that, that is so strange. Caters has entered adulthood. Very good. Gotta go put it to work. Oh man, this is awesome. I'm gonna use this as a as a part of the thumbnail. Look at her. Okay, wait, I gotta get the tree out of the way so I get a good shot. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think I'll avoid her for now. She looks mean. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> okay, so let's get the camera angle right again. Yikes, our, our tribe members are quite close. Um, careful, guys. Epic. There's an epic. Hey, what are you doing? Palesla. These guys are, are angry. So don't get too close. Alright, so where's the tribal chieftain? I'm gonna, gonna grab chieftain and these guys first two because they're the ones who are collecting I think and I'm gonna get them over here and we're gonna do the tribal I mean the the rain dance the refreshing refreshing storm do, do, do. I don't think we need actually all of them I think we just need the chieftain so watch this we do this you see the trees are bare at the moment just one little fruit there refreshing storm and then they get their the fruit back <laughs> get them to collect there we go awesome got 74 whoa and all the fruit falls off that's that's great lots of fruit okay chieftain back to work <laughs> just because you're the boss doesn't mean you can just stand around and do nothing okay so let's see get back to here we've got our uh, caters here he's protecting the stash still and very soon we're going to have enough to buy the maracas and the torch, fire torch stand. Look at that. <laughs> There's a little fried egg. <laughs> okay, delivering food. What? Plus four? Dander, are you slacking? Are you eating the fruit? Plus six? Oh dear. It's supposed to be plus eight with, with all the gathering. There we go, plus eight. Nice. Okay, so who's this one? He's a bit hungry. Okay, so we have a hundred. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy those two buildings now. The maraca stand, put over there. And we put the flaming torches on this side. Very nice. Okay. There we go. Wonderful. <laughs> He's very happy. See, what is this? What is this with the empty baskets? Come on, guys, it's Dander again. He's slacking. <laughs> okay, so Caters here is going to be staying here to guard things, so I'm going to get him with a flaming torch. He, he equips himself a flaming torch. There we go. Very nice. You stay there. And then, who's this? This is Dander. Dander, you're a terrible fruit collector. You're going you're gonna to go on a mission with our tribal chieftain. Because I think what we're going to do is we're going to go to the other village to try and make them our allies. Palesla, why are you not collecting? You should be collecting. Hey, wh what are they doing? <laughs> no, you, Palesla, you, you need to collect food. Um, come on. Any old tree will do. These are all bare. Here we go, here's lots. A whole forest full collect so we got two collecting 
one guard. Actually, I'm going to make another baby. Our last slot. Very good. Two collecting, one guard, and the baby can help the guard, I guess. And then the chieftain and Danda over here are going to go to the other village. And we just need to follow this, this path, I think. Oh, there's food right here as well. Yeah, I'm sure they'll find it. So, wait, did we... We didn't equip ourselves with maracas. That's what we need to do. There are the maracas. <laughs> Baby Riotan. Riot, Riot, Riotan. There we go, Maraca, and the chief, chieftain uses his staff for whatever he needs to do, so he doesn't need to equip himself. So let's go and take a look at this other village, shall we? We're in friendly stance, social stance. So let's go and take a look. They are yellow faced towards us, which means they're. In, yeah, they don't really care. They're not aggressive, but they're not exactly friendly. Rayatan has entered adulthood. Very good. Okay, so let's see if we can do this. Let's talk to one of them, the chieftain. Hello, chieftain. And now you see, what they do is, they demand that you play Maraca. So, we hit Maraca. <laughs> there we go. Again, Maraca. Again. I think numbers count with this. It's going up. Nope, nope, they, they didn't like it. They're giving us a four. Oh my gosh, a four. Okay, so I'm going to have to go get some more tribal members. <laughs> Baby Rayton grew up, so we'll get him. But the thing is, we cannot leave our food stash unattended. Let's see what we can do here. Um, hey, who's hungry? You, come and, come and eat. <laughs> what is this guy? He's just dancing at the fire here. Rayton, you'll be coming with us, so grab yourself a maraca. There we go, and are you eating yet? Yes, there we go, very good. And the chieftain needs to eat as well. You can see when we eat from the stash, then it goes down by one. So let's see, who was it? It was Danda. That's Caters. Caters is the guard. Stand here, Caters. There we go. Danda, you stay here, and you stay here. And we'll take Fiel in as well. And and that guy, can, Palesta, can continue being a farmer. No problem. Okay, okay, let's do it. He's all got maracas. And everybody's full, got a full stomach. Let's get back to the village. <laughs> Quite a mission. We twist the camera again. We are back, you ungrateful... What are they called? The Browns. The Brown Village. Okay, let's do it. Hello. Yes, indeed, we're back in numbers. So, let's do this again, shall we? <laughs> and they are... Yep, Maraca. Let's do it. <laughs> there we go. That's more impressive. <laughs> there we go. One more time. I think we can do it. Yes! The brown village is now your friend. Yeah! And we got a score of 10. <laughs> Very good indeed. So they are our allies, which is wonderful. So let's head back. I I know that we can give gifts to our allies, and they sometimes give us gifts. But as uh, more than that, I don't know what the benefits of the whole becoming allies is. We will find out, I'm sure. Um, okay, so, let me see. It's been 22 minutes. Are we going to do one more thing before continuing? Hmm. We haven't done any combat yet, which is actually a good thing. I wonder if we can domesticate an animal. Let's see if we can domesticate one of these guys. Come on, guys. Come on, team. They're getting hungry again, so i going to make this quick. But I think we could do it. Let's see. There's an alpha. We've got an alpha. And then... Come on. How do we do it? 
See, I'm not sure how to domesticate animals. It might require a different tool. Okay. Wait, wait, let's try these guys. Alpha M. Nope. It's making the bell like it's lunch, but we are, ca are not carnivals, so... I'll have to find out how to domesticate animals. Okay, so, yeah, that's it, guys. For this episode, I think we've started. We've got six tribe members, which is great. And I think I'm going to pause here. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you liked the video. I hope you liked the, our progress so far. And, uh, yes, um, tune in next time, right? Please don't forget to give the video a like, because it really helps the channel. Everybody's chowing down, because <laughs> they're hungry. And, yes, indeed, they deserve it. We've got an ally now, and uh, Palesto is still collecting food. Okay, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.